one thing I always hear on TV on ESPN is like, oh, like, yeah, we need to market it more. We need to market it more. Dog, 400 million people don't need marketing to play the <laughs> soccer, yeah. my nigga. What the on hell? On top of that, bro, like, Croatia has like 10 yo, million people, 20 million people. I, like, I'll say 400 this, million people, all they need is for it to drop in price. Then they will play. Lee, open a field. Lee, let me ask you a question, bro. Dang, you, you, like, live, you live in the States. Games. Let me ask you a question. Yeah. How often do you so- buy soccer fields to see kids just playing soccer? Never, never, bro. I coached I coach soached soccer. That's I, coached U- I coached at the U8, U10, U14 level. You know what the number one difference, the number one common thing between all these age groups? I used to coach the travel program. The travel program is much cheaper. It's like you represent mm. your city. But all the good kids don't... It's not even the good kids. All the rich kids don't play in the in the, in the city system because mm. there's no opportunity. Yeah. You're not, you're not going to get looked at. But all the kids that play in the city system never get looked at ever because they can't afford the clubs and everything yeah. like that. So it's like... I'll, I'll say this. Sag does coaching, right? And yeah. this man, he, he's seeing like the concept of a lot of kids they, and not only that, they get overworked because they'll do their travel thing. And if a kid wants to play for his high school team, it's like an extra burden. And it's not even as like, it, it doesn't yeah. go hand in hand. So a lot of kids just drop playing for their city, which mm-hmm. means no scouts, no nothing for your, for your, for your school team. Mm-hmm. Plus, you know what I mean? It's, plus, it's, it's tough. America, America's big too, bro. You could be the best guy That's in huge. Arkansas, bro. Where are you going to move to? You know what I mean? Like in, in, in Canada, there's hubs. Uh, it's Canada. It's Toronto. It's Vancouver. It's Calgary. It's Halifax. Yeah. Mm-hmm. They all so suck. ultimately, I, I think it's up to, I guess, the community's responsibility to kind of build that infrastructure. Mm. But as a personal responsibility, n- not really. I don't think it's anybody's personal responsibility. Like it, it's, it takes investment from the country. It takes a hand in hand. Like you, you need the country also to invest that also want that. You need the community to want that. So it's, it's a, a dual sided thing. I don't think it's just a one. Like I don't think like. The co- we can make a coalition and just decide we're going to make Canadian soccer better. No, it's impossible. Spot it on. starts from the nation in itself saying, hey, we want to compete with the rest of the world because the community has a passion for it as right. well. Mm. Right. Cause, 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 well sorry, sorry, I got to add, add to Mo because on, actually on. this is, this, how, do, how do I say this politely? This is actually a big problem in Toronto because there's a community in Toronto. It's not where I, not in Mississauga, in Toronto. They build, <laughs> they build. Certain soccer fields in certain locations. Oh, I know what you're talking about. You know exactly what I'm talking about. Anyways, there's a big group of uh, a certain community. Shout out to them. I like them. Great at soccer. But there's a good Great. reason because soccer is a lot more available in their yes. areas. As, them, in, right? as so. in parents convince a counselor to build a yes. whole turf field fenced Everything. off mm-hmm. between yep. the neighborhoods. And yep. if you're not by, from by there, the way, it's yeah. weird if you go there. Yes, yes. All right, I clocked. Field A field, fam. Oh it was, my god, that's it, literally... I promise you guys, this was the best field I've ever been to in my life. Wallahi, wallahi. Bro, and we were in small. shock. It's small. You could but play we like 5v5. Perf. We were allowed there. Big we nets. Were there. Bro, yeah. when we went there. We were not welcome. Looked at yeah. us like, 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 we just got off the boat, bro. <laughs> it was a lot. <laughs> a lot. And you know what's crazy? It was walking distance from our community, from our mosque. And we are like, yo, we not. We're not allowed here. Like, yeah, they're ready yeah, yeah. to complain. Like, they call, I mean, they did call the cops a few times on us. They're like, yo, you guys are playing too late or whatever as 12 year olds, but whatever. But, anyways, I don't want to get into it. Sorry, guys. Yeah, yeah. <laughs>